how five mysterious creatures caught on camera. Wrong turn. YouTuber The Highway 9 says that he was on a hike through the mountains with his dog Misty when he found a mysterious mine shaft. He decided to go exploring. Out. Out. Come here, come on. Come on. Go. Find some sleeping bats, but not much else. Until he decides to investigate one lone tunnel. It did not go well. Stay behind me. finds something lurking in the mine tunnel and decides to just get out of there. Now, several YouTube commenters claim that the video has to be fake because the dog Misty doesn't bark at the strange dark figure. But it should be noted that Misty seems to be very well trained and also doesn't bark when bats start circling their heads. It's also interesting that this is the only paranormal video ever posted on the Highway 9's YouTube channel. It's also the last video he ever posted. Right before your eyes. Indonesian YouTuber Panji is mostly known for a very different type of scary video. He usually can be seen interacting with very dangerous animals like venomous snakes and angry crocodiles. In this particular video, he and his friends are out searching the woods for wild animals. But they run into something very different. Oh. Panji and his team say that they didn't notice anything at the time. They continue walking, but then Panji sees the figure running in the darkness. Apaan itu, Pak? Lu lihat ya tadi, Pak? Lihatlah. Rining, Pak. Instead of running away, they actually chase the creature, but it's just too fast. They review their video and realize that the strange figure walked right by without them even noticing. Tuh, nah, itu, nah, kan? Itu. Nah, 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 nah. Gua enggak lihat itu. Enggak ada gua lihat apapun. Pas gua noleh ke kanan, ada yang lari. <laughs> so did Panji and his friends catch a mysterious creature on camera? Or is it all just an elaborate hoax? You decide. Creature Call This next video is probably one of the most requested videos on the Nukes Top 5 channel. A guy named Rick claims that he has been tormented by an inhuman creature that lives in the woods around his home. He says that he often hears the creature late at night or sees it lurking in the tree line. On this occasion, he set up a camera and claims that he finally caught the thing on camera. It's freaking thing. There it is, there it is. I put the iPad in the window and now this thing's coming up to the steps in my, my backyard, Mike. What's coming up? It's like a weird demonic looking thing and it's like a human. 
and it's all scratched down. And this is the second time this happened this week. And as I'm talking to you, this is all on recorded, and it doesn't see me. I'm in that, you know, that sunroom. Huh? Can I record it? You're on record. It's everything's recording now. It's it's. It, I can see the thing. It's like looking around weird. It's is it, it's is it a, recording the video. Yeah, right now it's on the video. It doesn't see me. I'm 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 sitting back, but I can still see out the window really good. You should see. Area? No, it can't. But it's looking around like something out of a weird sci-fi movie. This thing is freaky. Oh my god, like a gargoyle. It's like a gargoyle, man. And and it's like 35 feet away. And it it it's, it came out of those weeds. You know what I'm talking about? It's a plant. Right Everybody right? Looking out. Backyard. Yeah, on the right side, there's the weeds there going down that okay. sidewalk. It's looking, oh my God, oh my God. Dude, this thing is weird. And then it, and it goes back, it just went back. It went, dove back at it, it like, like wobbled back in. I can't even explain it. Back yeah, like it know it knows something's going on. I got it now. I got on tape. This is unreal. Oh my God! There it is, Mike. It came back. Oh my gosh! This thing is looking weird. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! It it knows something's going on, man. This thing is. Oh my God. I don't know what happened, we got disconnected. Rick still claims to this day that the video is 100% real, and he vehemently defends it. When asked the obvious question of why he didn't phone police, Rick says that he had already called police to his home many times and filed multiple police reports, but nothing ever happened. Rick says that he believes the police just thought he was crazy. But what do you think? Real or fake? Let me know. The coast isn't clear. In San Benito, Texas, two guys are out for a day of fishing on the local lake. As they move along the water, one of them notices something very odd on the shore. Okay, so it's something, a dog or what? Oh, la verga! <laughs> I got it on video, eh? Yeah. What the guys initially thought was an animal or a dog drinking at the water's edge suddenly stands up on two legs like a man. The two guys claim that the man, or whatever this is, was covered in hair. Now, the original video was very shaky and pretty much potato quality, but I've tried to stabilize it as much as I can. If you look closely, you can see that the man does indeed seem to be covered in something, possibly hair. But even stranger, he seems to run away on all fours like an animal. This is not the first sighting of this creature. Locals refer to it simply as the dog man. The Mississippi Skunk Ape YouTube user Josh Highcliffe was out in the woods of Mississippi, hunting for wild hogs. He says he was sitting on a low tree branch, being very quiet, when he heard something. Thinking it might be a hog, he looked around the tree, but instead he saw this.
something that Josh claims looked like an oversized ape was ripping into a large dead tree like it was made of cardboard. Josh says that at first he tried to be as still as he could, but when the creature stood up, he claims it was at least seven feet tall. Josh couldn't contain his fear and ran for his life. This is the only video Josh Highcliffe ever posted to YouTube. It has become one of the most controversial Bigfoot videos ever recorded. But what do you think? Is this Bigfoot or just a big fake? As always, you decide. If you see a spooky video that you think should be on the top five or if you've recorded one yourself, send it to me at nukestop5 at gmail.com. And come on over and say howdy on Twitter at nukestop5. As always, thanks for watching.